Hey guys, it's John, and today we are playing The Walking Dead, A New Frontier, Episode 1, also known as Season 3 of Telltale's The Walking Dead. You may have noticed this by now if you're a regular viewer on my channel, but I am not using face cam for this video. I use face cam on pretty much every video I produce these days, but I don't know, I just really felt like giving this one just, you know, the full spotlight, <laughs> so to speak. So, I really have no idea what I'm getting into. Apparently, Clementine's in this season, which I think everyone who saw the trailer already knew. So it's not exactly spoilers, but I did not see the trailer, so this is all new to me. I don't even know what we're walking into. Let's go ahead and get started. Adjust the slider. Uh, I'll have it like right here. Hope that's okay with everybody. Enable cloud saving. Um, I'm not doing that. Uh, last time I tried to do that in Telltale Batman, it lost my save, so I'm going to disable that. Fixes. He's backed up for miles. He's dead. No. No. I, I, I tried. You're a piece of shit. You know that? One time. Just the one goddamn time that you needed to be here. Okay. Uh, lay off, man. I tried. Please, I tried. Oh, you tried. You fucking tried? <laughs> Everyone's here. They've been here for days, and where the fuck were you? <clears throat> we're there, all around him. People who love him all around him. And he's scared. I'm seeing the panic in his eyes, and he's searching the room. Donde esta Javier? Donde esta mi hijo? I'm there, right beside him, holding his hand. Like a good son. And he doesn't even see me. He doesn't even see me because he's looking for you. You don't think there's a million places we'd rather be? You don't think we all had to make sacrifices? All right. He was my dad too, all right? I mean, you're not, you're not the only one dealing with this. And what a fine son you turned out to be. Uncle Javi? Why, why are you fighting? I could hear you from inside. Your dad's a bully. What's going on? I'll, I'll be silent. Just a misunderstanding between your uncle and me. Go inside, mijo. We'll be in in a minute. Go on. It's okay. Inside. Something tells me Gabe's going to survive the zombie apocalypse. And so is Javier, but not this dude. Fine, whatever. Just got bruised up a little bit, no big deal. I should call someone, pick up the body. Yeah. I love you, little brother. Oh, okay, yeah, sure, that you makes everything that, okay. Right? Fuck Everything's off. Doing it. Well, you got a pretty funny way of showing it. Good, I hope he does remember that. Fuck I you. I think I was jealous of you. N no, I, I don't think what? anything. You basically just said that. Well, I was. 
for a long time. Mm. You've lost more than I'll ever have. But maybe something good can come out of all this. Because we need you here. It's time to grow up. Hey, you're the one who you just... You can't run from this. Not anymore. You just punched me in the face. I'm not saying anything. Silent treatment. I don't like this. It's time to take some responsibility. I mean, I don't know what Javier's done. Like, I don't know what he's been irresponsible about. Javi. I don't have context for Kate. this. I'm so sorry, Javi. I'm so sorry. Thank you. Let's go inside. Your mom needs you. What happened? Come on. Ooh, Javier's a baseball player. Or at least he was at one point in time. <laughs> Mama. Where were you? Damn. What's hitting me? I tried. I tried. I'm so sorry. He's gone, mijo. He's gone. He's in a better place, Mama. No puedo conectarme. Dicen que no hay servicio. You thirsty, baby? You want some juice? Grandpa's cup was empty. You don't have to fill his cup up anymore, baby. Grandpa is sleeping. No, Yaya. People's awake. Oh, shit. Oh, he's a zombie. Ah, ha, ha. Cool. Yeah, this is dangerous. Ooh. Get away from him, man. Get away from him. I wonder if this is how it starts. No. No, she's gonna get bit. Yeah, this can't be how it starts. He he mentioned traffic. Javier. He did what had to be done. We need to go. We need to get her to the hospital. Well, let me look at it. Let me look at it. Gabriel, where's your sister? <laughs> keys. Where the fuck are the keys? Take Dad's car. Keys are on the dash. <laughs> Mama. Get the kids. Meet at the hospital. Don't take the highway. It's blocked. I'll bring the van around. Where's Mari? I don't know. Mariana. Well, 
the stars! Mariana, we have to go. Yaya's hurt. Come on, honey, we have to go. No, no, no! 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 Joel! It's okay. County General Hospital. I know the way. Oh no. Oh no. Yeah, because uh, Javier mentioned heavy traffic, so that makes me think that the uh, zombie outbreak has already begun. But maybe this is the first time they're seeing it, you know, in person. Oh, okay. And then present day. <laughs> Took the words right out of my mouth, Telltale. Tell me when it reaches the campfire. Wow, they're still alive? Both of them? Sheesh. I don't think I've seen this many. It's definitely growing. Yeah, not a great sign. Damn it, I left my water bottle. Her just got there. Just under four hours. Come on, we should keep moving while the kids are asleep. The kids are still alive. Yeah. You guys are impressive. I mean, to keep their entire group together like that, that is awesome, especially with kids. It looks like the herd is speeding up a little. I thought it was drifting southwest, but I'm not sure anymore. Every time I think we should just bed down somewhere and wait for it to pass, I can't shake the thought of us getting caught in the middle of it. It just keeps coming. It's slow, but that almost makes it worse. All right, we're gonna keep moving. Like we're in control. We're not. We should keep moving. It worked for us so far. As long as we stay supplied, we're fine. Jeez, Javier, yeah, pick a lane. Right. The van isn't so bad. We'll figure it out. We always do. Hey, I'm gonna sneak a smoke. I can't believe you found weed. What? Are you kidding? What? People were probably growing this before they realized they needed food. What? Okay, I'm sorry, but why would you do this with the zombies? What? No! I'm gonna. Okay, listen, I'm not against it, but come on. You Here? Really think we should be smoking now? Relax. Mariana's got headphones on and Gabe is drooling. I think we're no, I'm not worried about the kids. I'm worried about the zombies. You do not want to be high when zombies are around. No, no I'm not. Fuck, I'm driving. No, this is ridiculous. No. No, no thanks. One of us should be sober. Yeah. <laughs> driving don't, under the influence. Drink. I'm not. Ah, I'll judge you all I want. This is irresponsible. Oh, when I found out David had kids, I told him. I am not changing who I am around them. <laughs> and when he proposed, I reminded him that I'm not exactly stepmother material. <laughs> Case in point. He was reassuring, but you know, I could tell he was worried about it. I knew he'd try to get me to change. <laughs> or at least he'd hope that being around the kids more would change me, you know? <laughs> Do you miss him, stupid question? I suppose it did. All right. I'll say this. I'll be positive. It helps. I think you're doing a fine job. Not really, though. <laughs> I'm just saying cheesy. that. All right. I'm not fishing for compliments. Well, you caught one, all right? So, now what? I used to talk shit about all those mothers who'd go on about raising their kids being the hardest thing in the world. <sighs> Gabe's making me start to think they had a point. <laughs> His mood swings are just... Oh, I don't know. Some days I just want to leave him by the side of the road. He might not be asleep. Maybe don't say that. <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> Jesus. Obviously. Yeah. Yeah. I'm just gonna go with don't say that. You really shouldn't say things like that. 
I said it was a joke. It's half a joke. It's all joke. Look, I love these kids, but I could do without Gabe reminding me I'm not his mother whenever he's pissed. Man, he's a teenager. Puberty, hormones. The second you start getting boners, the whole world starts to get dark. What? Okay, that's a what quote of the episode. About? Sounds delightful compared to dealing with bloody underwear. <laughs> Christ. What a great conversation. Get laid. What? 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 <laughs> Javi. Javi. <laughs> stop. Stop. No. No. I realized that was an awkward transition. No. Get Sorry about that. Silence. No, I, I can't respond to that. I'm not going to respond to that. I'm not going <laughs> to. Are you shitting me? No. Mm. Uh, what's that smell? That's gross. It's weed, kid. All right, go back to sleep. She doesn't need to be worried about it. She's glaring. Hey, wow. Mariana, shouldn't you be uh, sleeping or something? I already know you guys do drugs. That's a... Uh pretty severe way of phrasing it, Mariana. Don't tell Gabe. He's the one who told me. Ugh. Oh my god. You're even smoking in the car now? Alright. Everyone roll the windows down before you all get contact high. We're rolling the windows down the supply stop. during a zombie apocalypse. Okay, yeah, sounds like a great idea. What could possibly go wrong with rolling all the windows down? <laughs> what a stupid thing to do. Listen, like I said, I'm not against, I'm not against marijuana, okay? But this is a, an inappropriate situation for it. I would think you would want to have all your wits about you be completely clear-headed all the time in this environment. Having a good time has its place. It's called at home with a pizza, not in a van during a zombie outbreak. Fucking hell. <sighs> Your hands are cold. <laughs> are you praying? All right. No, that's not necessary, Mari. We're all the protection we need. I'm praying I find a candy bar. <laughs> <laughs> all right. What do we actually need? Uh, I think candy Kate bar. wants a candy bar. Need Mariana, not want. Uh, fuck. Candy bar. Pretty much everything. I don't know what we need actually. If it looks useful. Let's use it. All right. Well, let's start with some gas and move up from there. <sighs> Wow, well, half the job's already done. Um, uh, I pressed E. What? What is going- I pressed E- I swear to God, you guys. All right, well, let's start with some gas. I'm not new to this. I've played Telltale games before, obviously. Okay, maybe this is a step that I missed. All right, I am... What is going on? All right, so the problem was my keyboard kind of crapped out. I had to restart my computer. I don't know why that happened. We're back on track now. And well, bam! Home run. Nice. Hey, where are you going? What, Gabe? Okay, Ugh. that's cool. Have fun. You can't be angsty Jesus. in the zombie apocalypse. Come it on. Never ends with him. I hate when they fight like that. I really hate it. It's like all Gabe wants to do is argue. It doesn't matter what it's about. I agree. Well, that makes two of us. But we're stuck with him, so... At least you have your headphones. Yeah, but the batteries have been dead for a couple of weeks. I mostly wear them to fool you guys. That's sneaky. <laughs> you... You sneaky little... 
That's smart. That's pretty smart. Be nice to find some dinner. In a junkyard. You never know. These past four years, people have been hoarding all kinds of shit in all kinds of places. Oh, and Mari, if there's any trouble, you can find one of these cars. Yeah? Lock yourself in and don't come out. Not even once it's quiet. And wait as long as you can. Okay. Good girl. What, did you just stow the gasoline can? Oh. <laughs> Wait, what did you put in your pocket then? Let's look at the barrels. Let's check them out. What do they got for us? Waste oil. No use to us. What a waste. All right. Should we go talk to Mari? She's kind of kind of far away. See, is there is there something this way, or am I just wasting my time? I'm just wasting my time, of course. Sup, Mari? Let's hey. have a chat. Any luck, kiddo? I need a pen. Or a pencil. Uh, just yeah. something to write with. Uh, a pen? Why are you looking for that? There's just something I really want. I really need to do, and I need a pen for it. Last night I was thinking about this stupid story my mom used to tell me all the time before bed. I used to hate it, but... But then I realized I don't remember the ending. It was this goofy ending she thought was so funny and I thought was so dumb. I want to write down everything I can remember about everything. Because if I forget and they're all gone, I'm kind of gone too. At least a little bit. I just think that might be kind of important. Maybe. Fine, I'll support it. That's a great idea, Mariana. Yeah, you need to, uh... You need to keep your... Your, uh... Fuck, I can't talk. You need to keep your wits about you. No, that's not what I mean to say. You need to, uh... Most keep your humanity. Whatever. The seats are gone. Ah, this thing's dead. No, oh, okay, well... He diagnosed that bus awful quick. Ooh, let's poke this mattress. Oh, that's gross. Dude, let's poke it. Let's do it. Okay. Now I'm sorry I did that. Why? Because it, it grossed up your finger? Maybe something would have fallen out of it, like a pen. Ever think of that? We're looking for two things now. All right. Ooh, we can we can siphon. Siphon, Once however this you pronounce made it. made someone very happy. Now it sits here, rotting away. How do you know it made him happy? He's la vida. <laughs> okay. Damn, Javi. Good job beating up on that poor defenseless zombie with no hands. You big bully. Alright, we got gas. Good. Ugh, not much. But every bit helps. Yeah, pretty nice. N nice, uh, siphoning equipment you got. I could hold a lot of gas. Could be really handy if we stayed for a while. Why would we stay here? Why would we stay here a while? Come on, Javi. Oh, brother. Alright, we gotta look for a, a pen, though. Acetylene. Handy for welding, but not much else. Okay, I'll take your word for it. I don't know much about acetylene. Gabe. I wouldn't have minded having one of these back in the day. That that was a lot of character building there. Cool. Hi, Gabe. What's going on in there, buddy? I'm in a bad mood, okay? I want it to go away, but he won't. I just wish we weren't always on the road. 
I like being with other people. Just, we're in that car for so damn long. The AC hasn't worked in ages, and it, it ain't my last damn tape. But we still got each other. It's better than nothing, right? I don't know. Maybe just leave me alone. Okay. But if you want to talk later, I'm around. All right. Well, I, I don't think that there was a single answer that he was going to like out of that group that I had. Ugh, I don't think these tires would fit the van. Maybe there's a pen in there. Ever think of that? Ever think about that? Could be a pen. Some sort of fuel tank. Really, a pen could be anywhere. We should look in the glove compartments. Tires, paint cans, old newspaper. <sighs> All that's left in this junkyard is... junk. Whoa. A fitting name, perhaps. There's nothing up there but garbage. It is a dump truck, so... Listen, I... Uh, I'm not trying to, like, shit on this game or anything. Because I, I enjoy it so far. But Telltale does have a bad habit of making you look at a lot of pointless stuff. I'm not going to climb that just yet. Too risky to search up there. Doesn't look stable. I think my least favorite ones are the ones where they just have the character, like, look at something. Like, you click on it and the character just looks at it and smirks or something. And that's it. We haven't had that so far, thankfully. Come to Papa. All right, that's kind of creepy. Barely anything. I'll need to find more. Well, no shit. All right, let's uh, let's siphon this. I just wanted to look around this one first. Looks promising. What about this one looks more promising than the other ones? They're all, like, junk. Bingo. Alright. So, I guess he's, he's content with that amount of gasoline. Why, I'm not sure. I think I've... Hang on, let me let me just check back here. I don't want to skip over anything. Sorry, I know it's annoying to some people. But... I have been looking forward to this for a very long time. Oh, hey, we almost missed out on talking to Kate. You find anything? I can't stop thinking about that herd. We get caught in it, and, and that's it. Peace, asshole. Can't charm your way out of that one. And we'd be gone in seconds. Hey, don't think about that. We're careful. We're smart. We'll stay ahead of them. <sighs> Luck runs out just as easily as gas. There's gonna be a last one, you know? A last tank of gas. Last piece of food. What if this place is empty? And, and the next? And the next? We're not gonna let that happen. Okay? <sighs> okay. I let it have its five minutes. I'm good. Probably smoking that devil's grass didn't help. Alright, uh, let's see. Oh yeah, there's that moldy mattress that I poked. Alright, I think it's, uh, ladder time. You guys excited to see what happens when we try to climb the ladder? Because I sure as shit am. Gonna leisurely walk my way over there. Gonna be a, a good time on this here ladder. Let's, uh, let's do it. Looks like there's more to see up here. Ooh, I can stay or go. Oh, this is a choice. I don't want to get separated. Hmm. A tough decision. Eh, what the heck? Any luck? Some. But not enough. Gabe? Hey, Gabe. Let's go take a look over there. Gabe, stay close to Javi. Got it? Oh, all right. 
Okay, you know what to do with that gas, right? You, uh... Go ahead and put it in the, um, thing. Okay, this is a loading screen. This might have been a very significant choice, much more than I anticipated when I made it. Hey, look. There's one they never took to pieces. Ooh. Good catch. Yeah, way, way to point out the obvious standout thing here. Oh, I thought we took- I thought we left the gas, but I guess he took it over the... the ladder. Um, let's look at it. Shh, you know what? Still might be gas in the tank, though. You know what might be in an ambulance? Pens! They gotta, like, write stuff, like, diagnosis and... and all, all that junk, right? Oh, shoot! Looks like it came from in there. Gabe, well, stay close. Well, wait, I want to siphon the gas. I didn't do that. What the? Uh, I didn't know this was going to just usher me into the next sequence. I just wanted to look over here for stuff. Javi, listen. We need to go back. Oh, Javi doesn't want to go back. Oh, Gabe is blocking the way. Nothing we can do about it. <sighs> Maybe there's a pen in here. Ransacked a long time ago. Oh, there must not be any pens in there. Javi has designated this a pen-free zone. My mistake. Dude, I wouldn't I wouldn't actually step on those steps. Just in case someone's in there. Come on. Have your wits about you, man. I think you're getting a little too curious. This is about when I would book it back. I'd be like, Might okay, get in through the hatch. ambulance, gasoline, that's a victory, I'm taking my leave, but, but this guy... <sighs> Looks pretty run down. He's getting kind of greedy here. On the other hand, maybe there are pens in there. Let's do it. We gotta get a pen for Mariana, it's very important. I'm on a pen quest. Oh, we're gonna pry it open. Not gonna be able to pry this open. Damn it. You, you didn't even try. You, you didn't even try! Well, I guess we give up. Um... Oh no, we're gonna go underneath. We are, aren't we? Wait. Guys. Who's small enough to fit in there? Who do you think we're about to meet, huh? Hmm... Who do you think we're about to meet? By the way, I did import my save from Walking Dead Season 2. Let's go ahead and open it. Boop! Gabe? I mean, I might be wrong. Come check this out! I might be wrong, because... Not the cleanest place. Oh, no muertos, at least. Not the cleanest place. Okay, health inspector. Get out of here. Just be careful. Alright. Something tells me that, like... If we had chosen to stay instead of climb the ladder, we would have had to climb the ladder anyway. Probably Gabe would have been like, I'm bored. And then we would have had to do it anyway. Which is kind of disappointing. Because, like, this is a lot of content that you supposedly wouldn't get if you didn't climb the ladder. Oh, it looks pretty comfortable. And pretty gross. Okay, so Clementine definitely does not live here. Are you kidding me? Lucky for you, they put enough preservatives in this stuff to last for centuries. Well, there's enough food in here to keep us going for a long time. It's also someone else's stuff. Oh, that was that's Mari. Okay. I thought <laughs> Uh, that scared the oh, fuck out of me. Out. This is actual, honest to God, pudding. Seriously? And it's not just food. There's a mattress. There's blankets. Someone else's mattress. Someone else's blankets. We need to just take our gas, 
and get on the road. This place is a dump. Yeah, I'm gonna say this place this. does have a funny feeling about it. And if Muertos were to somehow surround us. Great. Now I'm officially creeped out. Come on, one night. We bunk down, eat a real meal. It would be nice not to sleep in the van for a change. Please. The herd is coming if it's not here already. We should go and get ahead of it before it's too late. The fence is reinforced. We'll be fine. We I'm not, found this. I'm not going to listen to a teenager. Javi, can we? We could listen. stretch out, sleep well for once. No, Come on, we, you know we are not, not afforded that luxury, kids. We've got guns. We can protect ourselves. Not against a horde, idiot. We're going to get what we came for and get out of here. Great. Another shitty cramp night in our shitty cramp van. Hooray. Yeah, life sucks Come in the on. zombie apocalypse. Let's get used to it. The food. Man, I wish Clementine was here to set you straight, Gabe. Yeah, I sided with Kate there. I think it was the right thing to do. I mean... Yeah, I mean, probably we would be fine, Thanks but... Thanks for that. that you gotta back up all? Kate. Yeah. How does it feel to be the bad guy this time? It must be a new sensation for you. I'm gonna handle the kids. Oh, clearly I have a thicker skin. Hey, Kate. Wait, what's going on? Can you come help us with this? <sighs> Things have been too... Hey, uh, wait, but you... This oh, a candy bar. This way you make up for being the bad guy. Aw, nice. okay. Grab Thanks. Some gas. We need to head out soon. All right, what's about to happen? What the fuck do you think you're doing with our gas? Yep, this sucks. Oh, speak up! Um, I'm sorry, man. Look, it's just a can. We needed it really we? bad. I fucking knew it. There's more than just you out of here. Shit. You ain't the loner type. I can tell. I should have said that. Damn it, I didn't I think about it. I know you got people. Look, don't worry about them. They took off and then they're not coming back. Just up and left you, huh? <laughs> Fan out and look for the others. Lonnie, you're with me. Well, this went south. Imagine if we had chosen to spend the night. I guess it would have made a difference. Hey, you assholes in there. I got your bar. You don't want them getting shot. You best come out there careful with your hands up. Go on, you first. You get ambushed by your own people. That shit's gonna make my day. Awesome. Open it real slowly. Bam. Bam. Well, but sucker punch. Come around with me, boy. All right, fine. I gave him a little bit of time to get underneath the... Yeah! Good job, guys. Good job, good job. Looks like you and your friends had a real face time. Hey, yeah, one pudding cup. Yeah, it was great. You can't just take what you like. I don't roll over like that. I ate all those. Yeah, me. You? By yourself? Now, nah. yeah, what can I say? I fucking love pudding. You got a real smart mouth. You fucking watch what you say. Look, I, I, I get it, all right? You're starving. Who the fuck is it? At the end of your rope, thought you hit pay dirt. Honest mistake? He's gonna hit me. But I got this sneaky fucking feeling <clears throat> that you're full of shit. I ain't gonna let it be like the last time some assholes rolled on us. <laughs> Keep an eye on this dickhead. I'm gonna grab some cuffs. You got it. You got it. Uh. Just chill, okay? 
No need to make this any harder. Look, your buddy's not thinking straight. So let's talk, okay? You and me, we, we can get this sorted out. No, it's his call. Look, well, man, this doesn't have to go. What the fuck was that noise? What you got hiding under there, boy? Um. If you know something, you better spill it. You don't want me finding out for myself. Hmm. Ah, ah, ah. Oh no! Get him, Javi! Guys, get the fuck in here! Get him! Get him! Holy shit! Why'd you drop the gun? What'd you What'd you drop the gun for? Yeah, Why did you drop the gun? What she done here? Why did he drop the gun? Wait, wait, wait don't you? not going to shoot you. Damn, all right. Well, so is Kate down there with the kids? I assume. I hope so. They need an adult now that I'm fucking kidnapped. What if this is like Clementine's gang? Ooh, that's kind of rough. Hey, my family, where are they? What did you do with my family? Please, man! Just do us both a favor and pretend you're still asleep. I wouldn't start talking if I were you. You're lucky what? we do things a certain way. I'm already tempted to put a bullet in your brain for what you did to Lonnie back then. If we start talking, I'm gonna get angry. What happened to him was an accident. Yeah, right. Keep talking, we might find ourselves in a similar accident. You get what I'm saying? Please, you have to believe me. We were just... Not another word, or God help me, I'll put you to sleep myself. I don't think you have the authority to make that decision. Ahead of us, and I'm not about to listen to you. What the hell? Stop! Stop! Oh, shit! Ah, ha, ha. Are you serious? You're gonna put the gun on the dashboard right by me? I know I'm wearing cuffs, but damn. Hey! Let him go or shoot him. Let him go. That's fine. What's he gonna do? Like, come back and kill me for revenge? For what? What'd I even do to him? Nothing. Yeah, it's good that I didn't shoot him. <sighs> Fuck. Yeah. All right. That's Who is good. it? Just keep looking forward. <gasps> oh my god. Look, I'm no threat to you, okay? I surrender. Well, that's obvious. Seeing how you didn't shoot that guy. Fucking Clementine, I love it. Okay, now don't do anything stupid. Cause I'm not as nice as you. I won't hesitate. Ooh, I think that's based on my uh, choices in season two. Pretty Gosh, sure at least. I got a little ruthless in season two a couple oh, wait, times. did you do that with the tree? I was trying to stop the truck. Eh. What do you need the truck for? To drive. Put your hands up. And close your eyes. Look, I'm the victim here. We're all victims. Oh, so it's okay for you to rob me? This is payment for saving you. Oh, no. Hey, that's for my niece. She loves chocolate more than anything. I promised it to her. Please. Come on, Clementine. Keep your eyes closed and count to a hundred before you go. I'll she put Wait, it back. Just... My family. I need to get back to them. We were attacked and I don't... 
Look, I just need to know where I am. We were driving down the 522, and that's when we found the junkyard. They're still there. I need to get back to them. I know where that is. You said you were driving? In our van, yeah. I'll take you to the junkyard if you let me have your van. Ooh, that's I'll get all... you there in one piece, then I drive away. That's a rough deal. Ah, shit, that I can't do that. Is our home. It's all we got. That sounds like a no. How about you just give me directions like a normal person? How about I shoot you and take the van anyway? This is a better deal for you. Let's go. I I I, I can't give up the this van. Really There's a horde. I don't Herd. know you. Whatever. I don't trust you, and I'm not taking any chances. So it's safer for both of us if you're tied up. All right. Look, I get it. You're being cautious. Glad we understand each other. The name's Javier, by the way. People call me Javi. Clementine. Oh, there it is. There's that soft side. Well, thanks for not killing me, Clementine. Don't thank me yet. Damn, all right. <laughs> I got an achievement just now called In Her Charge. <laughs> Coming down with a shotgun, I love it. Oh, come on. Yeah, she's got this. Yeah, she's vicious. You're good at that. Look, you don't want to talk? Fine. But how about you give me that gun back so I can at least defend myself? For all I'd know, you'd turn around and use it on me. I didn't shoot that other guy. Look, I'm not gonna shoot you. I didn't even shoot the guy who had me tied up. Exactly. But I know you thought about it. Well, but I didn't. Well, what reason would I have to shoot you? Come on. I have a niece. Whatever, you don't know that I have a niece. The herd caught up with us. I know I, know I said I had a niece, but... Yeah, this is why we can't give up our van because of the herd. See, we're we're not gonna beat them on foot. What do you call them? Walkers. Well, what do you call the ones that run? They're all fucking walkers, okay? Look, I'm just <laughs> I'm not used to being around other people. Not for a while, anyway. Well, what happened Usually, to it's just Jane? Me on my own. Apology accepted. I wasn't apologizing. <laughs> Okay, so at the end of season two, I, I was with Jane and so the family in the warehouse. Junkyard. So I'm not sure what I happened after kids. that. And his wife. It's Where's the baby? Surviving this long. Not sure how you did it. Just keeping everyone together like that. Well, I didn't do it alone. My uh, well, uh, Kate helped. She did. Most of the work, actually. Sounds nice. Having a partner. It is. How about you? You must have been pretty young when this shit started. I was. But some people looked out for me, too. What happened to them? Same thing that happens to everyone. Clementine. Does that shit. mean that Jane's we dead? We stay here. There's a town up ahead. We can stay there until the herd passes. Otherwise, we're walker food. Um... Can you do that? Please? Fine. Whatever you say. Thank you. Don't make me regret this. Yeah, good. Come you won't on. regret it. I'm not gonna betray you. I played as you last season. And I played as your, your guardian in the first season. We're close, Clementine. Don't worry about it. There! Get to the gate! Let's keep going. They'll open up! Shit! Hey! Open up! Who is it? Till you clear them out. Can't risk 
skin. All right, awesome. Let's do it. Time to get some headshots. Fuck! These bullets won't fire. Save Clementine. Save her. 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 Wow. Get your ass inside. Come on now. Who? God, Who was that? Damn it, Francine. Oh. One of these days, those doors are gonna close, and your ass will be on the other side. <laughs> yeah. And when that day comes, Trip, I promise I'll eat you first. It's Clementine, right? You staying a while this time? No. Once the walkers pass, I'm taking this guy to a junkyard off the highway. My family might be trapped there, hiding from some very bad dudes. Well, shit. I'm truly sorry to hear that. This herd okay. rolled in pretty quick. We're hoping it's gone just as fast. So, just keep your heads down and steer clear of trouble. You got me? There's too much going on outside the walls tonight. We'll be cool. We'll be cool. Just need a place to ride out the herd, that's all. All right. I'm gonna hold you to that. And I wouldn't recommend changing your mind. If you wanna hang on to all your teeth, that is. All right, now sheesh. Head on in. I got shit to do. I, mean, I wasn't well, planning on coming here and causing Prescott. trouble. Prescott? Wonder how we ended up here. You know, I was thinking it's about cool it. Place, actually. I'll talk in a second. Built from an old airstrip, I guess. The people, on the other hand, they're not my favorite. Usually, I'm in and out as quick as I can manage. Not exactly an option this time, though. No, no, this place is actually kind of charming. It's got walls all the way around, and, well, that thing. Yeah, like I said, this is a pretty cool place. Javi? Hey, Javi. What's, what's up? My family, they're still out there. If you guys made it this long, I I'm sure you know, you'll know what to do. Hopefully. Let's go, this way. I like how she's I calling me Javi. Some bullets. So you know, okay, well I don't know if I have time to talk. I was gonna talk about my theories regarding the bridge between season two and this one. And how they did it. Jeez, I haven't been in a place like this since, well, you know, it's just like the old days. Listen, I gotta take care of something. Hang tight. Oh, wait, wait, what should I do? I don't know, why don't you make some friends? I already made one. Da 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 da. Okay, so as I was saying, just want to talk for a second about this. Uh, season two ended, I think, five different ways. There's two endings with Kenny, two endings with Jane. Uh, both Jane endings, you can either choose to accept the family into the warehouse or whatever, or not. Carver's place, I think. And then the two Kenny endings, uh, I think one, he takes you to the town. I wonder what happened with that. And then the other one, something else happens, I can't remember. The two Kenny endings are the best one. Best ones. And then the fifth ending, she's just by herself with the baby. So, I was always wondering, like, if they were going to have Clementine in the this season, the, uh, the nominal uh, season three, how they were going to bridge that, because they have five different endings. So, I'll be interested to see, like, what happened. Clearly, Clementine's on her own here again, and there's no baby, which is very interesting. Looks like I, someone's in the middle of a game. Either someone's taking care of it, or it's dead. And you also gotta wonder what happened to Lily. We haven't seen her since season one. Or, um, uh, what's her, what's her face from the beginning of season two? Clarissa? That's not it. I can't remember. Chess. Not really my game. What? Chess is great. Gabe used to play, though. Well, maybe you should play him in chess. Let's talk to this guy. He looks like he's having a rough night. I wonder where they found this old thing. 
I haven't seen one of these in years. Cool. <laughs> All right. Look at that shotgun, dude. Wonder if it's loaded. Probably not, because then someone could just pick it off the wall and kill people with it. Play your hand. You're gonna lose, but you don't have to do it in slow motion. Don't try and rush me. <laughs> I know your game. This is my game, clearly. Always a smart ass. Well, it ain't gonna work. Look at that smirk. Let's talk to him. Excuse hey, guys. Me. Oh, you again. <laughs> you got some moves. I'll give you that. What? I do? Hold on a minute. Don't I note you from somewhere? I don't know. Maybe. Garcia. Javier Garcia. What? For what is worth, I think you got screwed on the gambling thing. A lifetime ban. Shit. What? Should have had a 20 year career. The way I see it, nothing wrong with betting on yourself to win. Was, was he a baseball player? And that got a lifetime ban? Nah, he just wanted to set an example. I was the poor bastard they used to do it on. All I know is what I read in the papers. Anyway, I'm Conrad. This here's Francine. He runs the place. I just take his money. <laughs> yeah, well, maybe I'm just letting you win. Oh, actually, if you're the gambling type, game's poker. Five card stud. I'll raise you. What do you think? Should I call or should I fold? I, 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 hmm. I don't, don't get too intimidated. I don't I know. I lose more often than I can. Fuck, I don't know. Though all it takes is one good hand. He's bluffing. He's got bullshit written all over him. <laughs> is that a fact? Right. Oh. I think I'll listen to the man. Call. Moment of truth. Flip him. Oh my. Ain't that a pretty sight? Does he oh, win? Hell yeah! Nice. Okay. Well, calm down, both of you. Thanks for the advice. I, I don't know how to play poker. How's Sorry. On my tab. Bottoms up. Wow, man, this smells like turpentine. <laughs> That's the weak stuff. Don't turn away from me. I'm talking to you. Oh shit. Hey, what's the point in talking when I already told you a deal is a deal, and it's done? What the fuck is on? happening? This guy ripped me off. I traded him a crate of perfectly good batteries, and he gave me a box of bullets that won't fire. He could have gotten both of us killed. Oh, yeah? And who the fuck are you, a bodyguard or something? Because I don't scare easy, all right? And I don't respond to threats, neither. She doesn't need a bodyguard. She could take care of herself. Believe me. Yeah, well, you can't even prove those are the bullets I traded you. Oh, hey, Clem, come on. He knows the bullets don't work. Listen to him. He's not even nervous. <gasps> I could have died because of his bullets. Oh, fucking believable. Look out! <laughs> what the fuck? Fuck this guy. He's going down. Listen, let's all cool down, huh? You were acting crazy, I was too. Oh, you yeah, just sure. Got a little out of hand. Just a misunderstanding. Just give me what I'm owed. Jesus, you gotta get her under control, man. Me? What? This ain't no way to do business. Boy, you have it wrong, buddy. I don't control her, which looks like bad news for you. He had a deal. All right, hey, okay, all right, so, hey, we'll, we'll trade back. I'll find some batteries. I don't need batteries. What I need are bullets that won't get me killed. Oh. <gasps> oh, no. Oh, no. What? 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 Drop what? What? The what? Gun. What? Right now. See, what? What? He attacked you and that he was going for his gun. I what, fucking what, what? warned you. Eli attacked what, him. What? I what? only shot because... Shut what? It. What? What? You've done enough talking. Drop it. There's a herd out there, and you're firing off a fucking. What the fuck happened here? Oh he shit! Hobby, okay? It was self-defense. Enough from you. Did she really have to shoot? She didn't. She didn't have to shoot, but I gotta stick up for her. Ah oh, man. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Look at my eye, man. Of course she's telling the truth. 
The guy ripped her off, reached for his gun, and would have shot me if she hadn't stopped him. See? You happy now? <sighs> God damn it. I'm putting you two under lock and key until I figure out what to do Whoa. with you. Whoa! Okay, what? Are you for real? He would have done that no matter what. Gets. Now move it. Got some nerve coming in and fucking up my bar. Oh man, everyone's mad at me now. I got an achievement. Deal gone bad. <laughs> I'd have punched your fucking lights out. Both of you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was a grade A certified dipshit. I'll even have someone come take a look at that cut. All right. I knew your threats were empty. Get hey, out of here. Going to punch thanks me. Thanks for having my back at the hangar. No problem, that bud. A, that was cool of you. I wasn't sure there for a minute. We're a team. Of course. Anytime. Well, I mean, you and I are a team now. Thanks. I mean it. Sure. Just don't think this makes us friends or anything. Oh, okay, we're a team, but not friends. Got Hello? it. Hey, what's up? How you doing? I'm Eleanor. I'm what passes for a doctor around here. Ow. Trip sort of overdoes it sometimes. I was kind of hoping you came over here. A cage. Like you're some feral animal. For pleasure instead of business. And I'm starting to think this trip guy, kind of a prick. He means well. He's just got a lot on his shoulders. Now, let's see about that wound. Yeah, please. Yeah, he got you good. Try to hold still. <clears throat> Why is it always the pretty ones who end up causing the most trouble? Whoa! As if good looks equal bad behavior or something. Whoa! Whoa! <sighs> I've never understood it. Are you calling me pretty? I was talking about Eli, the dead guy. What? Oh, yeah, good. Because I prefer dashing. Or debonair, maybe. Yeah, I'll try to keep that in mind. Yes, know how to reference me, please. People are saying she killed a man in cold blood. That is not what happened, exactly. If you don't mind me asking, what did happen exactly? Clementine is not asleep. Are you arguing and that she went crazy over nothing? That guy had it coming. Believe me. Karma, justice, you call it whatever you want. But fuck that bastard. Hey, okay. If you say so. I do say so. He did try Best to stab her. It's probably for you two to leave town. And get back to your group. We were attacked earlier this evening. There were four of us. Oh, shit. I'm sorry. If there's... If there's anything I can do to help. Anything? Uh, not that I have much to offer you, but... I know a thing or two about losing family. How about a kiss? Uh, you're helping now. I'll just say this. I don't want to get greedy. Hey, it's okay. You've done enough. I hear you, but... Eleanor? Yeah, you swabbed you my eyebrow. Yet? Congrats. All right, here's what we're going to do. I'm driving you that junkyard myself. Get you out of my hair, and no one can say I didn't do right by no one. In the meantime, you two can sleep right here and think about what shitheads you were earlier. On my terms and on my timeline. You got me? Fair enough. I'm not I'm gonna tr cause trouble. I'm gonna be boring. I'm gonna be boring answer. Right. Fair enough. Fair enough? Go kiss a skunk's ass. I should be earning a goddamn Boy Scout badge for this. Well, I said Trent, I said fair it enough. Seem right to wait. Javi's people, they can need a medic. No, nah, no way. Not putting you in that kind of danger again. That's not I your like call. you. I want you to stay here with me. Trip. Look, maybe there's another way. Oh, are you gonna bust this out? We've got a rear gate down at the other end of the airfield. We don't use it much, but well, we could leave tonight. Wow, we're already making plans to run so away together. Guard, get a jump start on reaching that junkyard. The family does need help. I'll be right there to give it. God damn, you move fast. All right. What? Seriously? When you do that for me. It's just, it's the right thing to do. Anyway, think about it. Oh, I've no. I've got to check on some patients, but I'll be back in an hour. We're going to have to romantically choose between Kate and you the know, doctor girl. I, I can't remember her name. I guess she had it in her. Yeah, she's 
She's something. I gotta hey, thank me for sticking up for you. Maybe this sounds again. weird, but I still trust Trip more than I trust her. No, I, I, I get you. I understand. No, I. Oh shit! I got another choice. Why? No, Eleanor. That's her name. Okay. No, she was moving real fast. It's true. I, I totally get what you mean. That is. I, uh, Oh man, this is tough because like, here's the thing. If we leave with Eleanor tonight, Trip's probably gonna get real mad. He knows where I was going to the junkyard. We might have to face that later. On the other hand, we like legit might need a doctor around and it doesn't hurt to have another body. Trip's certainly not gonna uh, fight with us or anything, fuck. But on the other hand, she did offer that up real quick so it does make me kind of question her motives maybe she has alliances with the people at the junkyard maybe that's like her original group or something and she's kind of you know has loyalties there and she could uh she could call us out she does seem like way too nice trip seems like an asshole but i understand what you mean clementine this is a tough choice, honestly. I'm trying to reason through it. I... On the other hand, you know, we wait a night. Who knows what could happen? And also, on the other hand, if we leave with Eleanor tonight, we're moving through the the herd. Fuck, there's like, there's like uh, three different pairs of things to weigh here, in my opinion. I'm gonna go ahead... I'm gonna... I think having a doctor would be good. Ah, this is a tough choice. I'm gonna go with this actually because I think it might be more interesting. That's what's gonna break the tie for me. We're I think it might be a more interesting choice. Eleanor. If it gets us there even a minute sooner, it's worth it. All right, I'm in. Yeah, I've stuck up for you plenty you know, of times. When I met you, I thought you'd just be another asshole like everyone else. I care about my family. And to think that when we first met, you nearly blew my head off. <laughs> yeah, guess I made the right call. You guess? It sounds like Eleanor will be a little while. Maybe we should get a few winks. Good idea. I'm exhausted. I'll get the lamp. I mean, really, we just gotta wait anyway, so... We don't really have a choice. We just have plans, you know? Oh, we're getting a flashback. Do we get to choose what happens in the flashback? It kind of hurts. I'm sorry. I know it sucks. Hi, Jane. I'm... I haven't been sleeping well lately. I've noticed. So many people died here. So many ghosts. Sometimes they're all I think about. Especially during the night. Eh. It does sometimes freak me out. Who knows what Carver did here that we didn't see. Yeah. Hey, look, Goofball. It's you. Alvin Goofball Jr. Can you say Goofball? You know, he does need a middle name. His parents, they never got a chance. You think? Go on. Pick one. No time like the present. Alright, this is gonna piss off Jane, but we gotta... Do it! How about... Kenny. I know how you felt about him, but I wouldn't be alive without Kenny, and neither would AJ. Good point. Not my favorite, but... Well, I guess that makes sense. I was just thinking Jamie was pretty cool. For a boy or a girl. Yeah, I know. Jamie, that was your sister. Yeah, obviously. Yeah. I used to think that if I was ever... picking out names, I'd... Yeah, but you're not, are you? Uh -huh. Anyway, the deal was ink first, then a perimeter sweep. But I just checked it a few days ago. We're on our own here, Clem. 
And after that asshole family we let in made off with half our food, oh, we can't God take damn any it. more chances. Really? It won't take long. Fuck. <sighs> they seem nice. Nice enough. Nice people get hungry too. And then suddenly, they're not so nice anymore. So get to it. I want you to be prepared. For anything. I know. I'm gonna go take a little nap. I'm, uh... Not feeling that great. Is she gonna die? Like, is she... Sick? Maybe she's thinking about leaving again. Ooh, that could be bad. I don't know. All right. So the family I let in made off with half our food. Awesome. Perfect. Great. Jane? No. No, 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 no. Are you serious? If you're not feeling well, I can bring you something. I am so disappointed right now. Oh my god! Why? Oh... What? 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 You're gonna make me do it, huh? All right. Oh, man. Well, I guess that answers our question about what happened to Jane and the family, but not what happened to the baby. Achievement unlocked. A hard goodbye. Fuck you, Telltale, with your cheeky-ass achievement names. Oh, it was a hard goodbye, huh? That's well, kind of tough. Sun's up. <sighs> Chip's probably mad as hell by now. We're taking horses, really? <laughs> I know this was the fucking 19th century. What do you think he'll do to you? Oh, nothing. He'll yell at me a little. Chip and I... We sort of used to be a thing. But we're a new thing now, right? It was for like five minutes, and it fizzled out fast. You can do better. They never really got over it. Not that he's weird about it or anything. Well, I'll just, I'll be vague. having me around. Relationships can change pretty fast, and they're never not complicated. Sounds like you've got something on your mind. Or someone. Guys. What? That's the place. You jealous? You jealous, Eleanor? Yeah, this is it. Oh, shit. What, there's a fire? What's happening? What is going on? Guns out, yeah. If you insist. Well, you got the biggest gun. You have the best gun. So I hope you have it out. Jesus. Must have been hundreds of them. Kate's going oh. in crisis. She'd know how to get shelter. What's that? Yeah, good thing we didn't stay here, huh, kids? Well, I guess they stayed here anyway, whatever. Oh, no, that's uh, Gabe's cassette player, isn't it? That's not Gabe. Good. Yeah, he's too decomposed. All right, let's, uh, let's make quick work of this guy. Let's smash the cassette player. Just kidding. No, but we need to... Uh... Mariana's tape player. Oh, it's Mariana's tape player. Sorry. Mariana? Mariana, are you here? Javi! Oh my god! Oh my god! You're safe! I can't believe it! You told this... me where to hide. I just listened to what you said. Oh my god, so that means Plus you're separated. Don't come out. Not even once it's quiet. It kept running through my head, like, on a loop. 
I don't even know how long I was in there. Then I heard your voice. You did exactly what you should have done. I always knew you were a smart kid. Thanks. It was scary at first. But once the muertos couldn't see me anymore, they just passed by. Kate and awesome. your brother, where are they? We got pulled apart when that huge bunch of muertos showed up. Kate yelled that they were going to try to make it back to the van. Then that's where we're headed. Let's go get your brother back, sweetie. I don't like you. I don't like Eleanor. No. She's too... She's sickeningly sweet. No, the van! No. No sign of them. They must have seen it like this, then gone someplace else to hide. Kate. What? It might not be Kate. Oh no, that is her. Ariana, stay back. Wait! Nobody shoots. What? Why not? He's right. We fired the truck. We might hit them. Oh, that's true. This is careful. I, what did I just say? This is careful? Okay. <laughs> this is a situation in which to be careful is what I meant. Telltale changing up the QTs on me. Assholes. What? Oh, shoot. Yeah, nice. Javi, you found us. Hey, hey, it's okay. I got you. You happy to see me? What? Ah, ah, oh, ah. I'm happy to see all of you. Everyone. Happy you're all okay. Another couple of minutes. We might not have been. But then, you showed up, just when it really mattered. Yeah, well, that's kind of my thing. Oh. I, I wanted to come after you. I, I swear I did. You don't have to snot all over my shirt about it. I thought we were dead. Like, never gonna see you again dead. We only had a couple bullets left. I thought we were done for. You're still alive, aren't you? Yeah, let's get him so hooked on the positive. So is Mari. That's all that matters. I was just so scared. I'm here now. You don't have to be scared. Hey, you hurt yourself. You must have scraped it in the truck. Didn't even notice. Hey, at least it's not a bite. Eleanor, think you can take a look? So glad we have a doctor for the fucking scrape. It's okay. I'm a doctor. I'll clean it here, then patch you up back home. See? Better already. Got a swollen hand there. Back. Don't want to push her luck. Who's the kid with the gun? She have a name you want to share with us? Or are you going to make me do my own introduction? She's not my friend. She saved my life. Pulled this crazy stunt. Let me get the upper hand on the asshole who took me away from you guys. Her name's Clementine. Hi there. Glad I was able to help. Well, we're very grateful to you. Really. There's a town nearby. It's safe. What, you I think like we can go back? Me. You think we can go back to it? Are you serious? Wait, was that the... That was the plan, oh huh? Oh my god. Javi, do they have hot water? Trip's not Even gonna like this, though. Trip's gonna get okay. mad. We didn't leave with him. I, would, I wasn't aware this was a long-term plan. Wouldn't bubble bath be amazing? Eh, don't get your hopes up too high. It's a nice place, but it's not the Ritz. Well, whatever they've got, I'm sure it's gonna be great. These kids don't know what the Ritz is. You're Hi. Happy. Hi, Eleanor. Uh, I don't trust you. don't usually end so well. Alive and healthy. Sort of incredible. Well, let's wait to celebrate until we're back behind the walls, okay? I didn't mm. I want to jinx us. I'm just happy for you is all. When we get back to Prescott, you still owe me a working ride. I never agreed to that. Forgotten about our deal. I did. I never happened to your van, Fucking still, I need I, some way out of here. I never fucking said that. Don't worry, I haven't forgotten our range. I'm just gonna go with it because it's not the easiest thing to find, but cool.
Hey, remember that girl from season two? God, what a waste of time. No! No, what? What? No, 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 no! Of course, of fucking course. Things were going too well. Oh no, the horses. Don't kill the horses. Mari. We can't leave her. <sighs> no, Kate, Kate, are you fucking kidding me? Kate! Are you fucking kidding me? No! Stop! No, Stop. Gabe! Gabe! Gabe, I swear to God. He's not gonna die, he's too angsty. There's too much character development, potentially. This is ridiculous! Fucking hell! I don't know! What are we gonna return fire on? Like, I have a pistol. They all have machine guns. Go! There we go. That worked out, I think. I can't believe it. You have? You have an assault rifle. I know, Javi. And there will be time for all of that, but not right now. I need to get Kate back to Prescott so I can help her, which means we have to go. We have a window here, Javi. We have to move before they start shooting again. I can't leave her like this. I won't. That's not gonna bring her back, Javi. Now get up. We can't wow. wait anymore. Tough love. We stay here and we finish this. Are you crazy? We have to go now. I already oh, no. killed one of you. If we don't stop them, they're gonna come after your family again. Let Eleanor help them. You stay with me. What? No, uh, Javi, you have to come with us. Javi, please. This is a rough choice. We have to end this now. No, Javi, please come with us. Please. Javi, come on. Get her back to Prescott. We'll cover you. Yeah, you need Javi. cover fire. You're not no, gonna be able to just waltz out Javi, here. Fine. I need your help, Gabe. It, just I mean, keep firing until they're out of sight, okay? Like, they're just gonna shoot you if you try to leave. So, we need cover fire. That's my reasoning. What? You got a fucking pipe bomb, you piece of shit? This isn't fucking Don't. Left for Dead. Idiots. Fuck you. What? That's the end of the- this is the end of the episode, guys! <sighs> Alright. I really enjoy looking at the choice- the choices. I think it's really interesting what the majority chose. Did you stay the night at the junkyard? I was in the minority. Interesting. Bunch of gay brown nosers out there. Just kidding. Most people let the driver go. It's pretty even though. These are pretty even choices so far. Like are hovering around 50%. Wait. You could not get locked up there? It says what was the aftermath of the shooting. So I guess no matter what, Clementine shoots that guy. Interesting. I'd be interested to see how you avoid that. Then again, okay, here's the deal. Like, you're you're playing Walking Dead Season 3. You're gonna stick up for Clementine there. I would assume that that's... the major impetus behind this gigantic majority here. We have such an investment in her character. It's hard not to stick up for her there. Oh, minority went with Eleanor. Majority went with Trip. I kind of understand that. I almost did it myself. That was a tough choice. Yeah, again, we see it here. The loyalty to Clementine is strong. 84%. Awesome. All right, let's uh, check out the trailer for episode two. Trailer, 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 trailer. You got a trailer? Trailer, trailer, please. No, shoot. Well, it makes sense because like, uh, so you guys may not know this actually. Uh, if you haven't been hearing all the news about 
the new Walking Dead, but they actually, episode two was released with episode one. So we have another episode to play. Episode three obviously is not out yet. This looks a lot like Jesus from the TV show and comic books, which is very exciting to me. Uh, that might not be him, but it looks a lot like him. The beanie, the bandana, the beard, the hair, the, the coat. And uh, I, I really like Jesus from the, from the show. All right, so um, basically what's gonna happen next is I'm gonna play episode two uh, and post that probably tomorrow because these videos take a while to get up, obviously. But hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Actually, I really liked this and I, I, to put it lightly, I have not been Telltale's biggest fan lately. I thought I played through all of Telltale Batman and I thought it was legit awful. So I'm, I'm not Telltale's biggest fan. I was really disappointed by Game of Thrones as well. Really disappointed. I posted that on YouTube. I didn't post uh, Batman on YouTube, but I did stream it on Twitch. Um, subscribe to Harshly Shitical if you'd like to see those. I, I think I might put those up. I'm not sure. We'll, we'll see. I, I'll, I'll try to. If not, they're on my Twitch channel archives. But uh, yeah, this is legit so far. I'm enjoying it. There's something about the Walking Dead universe that really lends itself well to Telltale's format, which they refuse to drop or change. So I think that this uh, is is good so far. And I know that, you know, probably Telltale had honestly their best people working on this series as compared to like Minecraft story mode and Game of Thrones and some of the side series that they've had, you know, Guardians of the Galaxy coming up next year. So I'm really excited to see what they do with this. Um, I think it's good. I think they handled it really well. I was really worried about the transition between season two and this one and how they were gonna connect them, like I said earlier in the episode with like the five different endings, but they've done well so far. I mean, you would think, um, and, and I think one of my theories when I was thinking about that, I don't know if I talked about it on video ever, but one of my theories when I was thinking about how they were gonna connect them is that they all end up with Clementine alone with the baby, because that was one of the possible endings, you know, so either way, you know, Jane or Kenny, you know, bye-bye. <laughs> but, uh, I, so I knew that Jane was probably dead, but I wanted to see what happened to her. I did not expect that to happen. Very interesting. So yeah, that does leave the question though of what happened to the baby and maybe we'll find out in an episode two flashback. But yeah, really enjoying this. One thing that I think is interesting here is that we're playing as Javier, right? And he appears to be the main character of this season, which as I said, I haven't seen any trailers so I didn't really expect that we may very well see Clementine die this season. That is a real possibility. And if you think about it, you know, it, it would be a bold move because Clementine is the one thing that's been connecting all three seasons of The Walking Dead. However, they, I think that at a certain point, it may be a good decision for them to break off from her, you know? So that might be what they're doing with introducing all these new characters. On the other hand, you know, maybe Javier and his whole family will die and we'll play as Clementine again in, in season four. So anyway, those are my thoughts so far. I'm really enjoying this. Well, we'll do uh, episode two very, very soon. I know, you know, I completely understand if you want to watch it somewhere else because plenty of people have already posted it. But plenty of people have already posted episode one and you made it this far. So hopefully I'm just... Uh, preaching to the choir at this point. Anyway, let me know what you thought in the comments. No spoilers, please. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next episode. Think critically.